I will show you three cool mixing tips. Hi, I'm Marlon and this is the White Noise Studio. For this video I will use the song Push A Man by Dragneck as an example. I did a full recording, mixing and mastering breakdown of this song and you can find the video here. Before we start, please subscribe to this channel and hit that notification bell so you know when there's a new video online on this channel, a channel to help you out in recording, mixing and mastering. Okay, here are the three tips. Tip 1. If drums are not sitting right in a mix, consider tuning them. Even by tuning half a semitone can make a drum sit right in the mix. A quick example. Here are the drums of the song Push A Man by Dragneck. The floor tone was originally like this. Uh, it doesn't sit quite right and if you tune it up by half a semitone, all of a sudden it fits in the mix. I have done this with toms, snare drums and even bass drums. So also consider tuning the drums next to EQing and leveling. Tip 2. Don't be afraid to render or commit a mix decision you make because then you can focus on the rest of the mix instead of a small detail. But if you are committing, always save a new version because if you have to go back to a previous version, at least you have it. Tip 3. Try adding distortion or saturation on the bass instead of EQ. The added harmonics will bring out the bass better. Do this when EQ doesn't work. Here's the bass guitar of Pusherman with distortion and on and off in the mix. This was part 2 in my mixing tips series and here you can find part 1. Please subscribe to this channel and like this video and I'll see you next time. Bye!